Hello everyone, welcome along. Um, this is a quick live broadcast. As many of you know, I'm at the moment, I'm running a online learning experience for underwater photography called Underwater Photography Reboot. It's a collaboration with a British based photography teaching website called um, Photography Experts. Um, I get lots of emails and questions asking me what, what it's like. And rather than sort of reply endlessly, I thought I would um, record a quick video to sort of try and answer some of those questions and tell you a little bit about the course. Um, so far, I've run four classes of this course, four groups um, of photographers have been through this course. Um, the first two groups have finished and the second two groups are halfway through their course. And relatively soon, I'll be launching um, the, the next instalment. So I thought I'd put this out there to help answer those questions. Underwater Photography Reboot um, is a five session class with, with sort of four main teaching sessions. Um, but I, I'm really keen to stress that it's a live class. So all the presentations are not pre-recorded. Each time I, I you know, we, we gather together as a group and I do the presentations and they're very much a two-way dialogue. Um, the people on the course are invited to unmute at any time and to ask questions throughout the presentations. And that way, um, and, and also to ask for more detailed explanations on things maybe I don't explain exactly the way they understand. And as a result, it's a very much a, a two-way dialogue during the, the presentations. The Underwater Reboot is aimed at existing underwater photographers. Um, it doesn't matter if you've done workshops with me in the past or haven't, um, but it's, it's, it's aimed really at kind of resetting your underwater photography to remind you of the key things that go into producing amazing underwater photos and, and, and to present those across the four big topics of underwater photography. And so the four classes of, of Reboot are divided into wide angle, macro, composition, and, and lighting. And we go through those over the four weeks. I have to say though, it's a very big course. I really, you know, I literally started with a blank piece of paper for each presentation or, or several sheets of paper actually, and wrote down everything I thought was important. I then went and looked at all the, the books and articles and you know, things that I'd written in the past and the, you know, the books and articles that I think were really good out there, you know, whether they're, you know, in publications or online and sort of put all that information down and poured all of that into these lectures. So it's a very comprehensive, big, holistic view on all these subjects. And people really like that kind of, you know, that um, that sort of, you know, deep dive all in one go on these these big pre these big topics. Um, it's although it's a live class, all the classes are pre are recorded. So after the class that you're a you join, you are able to watch that recording back, um, you know, for the whole year. So you can take it in. There's a lot of information in each of the presentations. And as a result, I wouldn't expect anyone to sort of take it all in in one go. But you can watch the videos back, the recordings of the presentations that we've done together as many times as you want to. And obviously, that's where people's comments and questions really enhance it because that that part of it you know is also in the recording um the class also comes with course notes for each of the topics so you have a quick reference um guide for that um and um and that sort of feeds into it but the other aspect of the course that i'm really proud of is that working with photography experts they've got this whole kind of infrastructure that helps the group really bond together and learn together and that was really important part for me because I know on my underwater photography workshops that people learn so much, not just from me, but from the interaction with everyone else during the during the, those events. And I really wanted to replicate that on this online learning experience. So the group size for each workshop is limited to 20 and it's the same, you know, 20 people throughout the, the whole whole event. Um, and we have a private forum for each of the groups where you're set assignments by me, where you, you know, to, to share pictures and to critique each other's pictures. And obviously I add my critique as well to those things. But I'm really keen that everyone, you know, expresses their opinions, everyone shares their pictures, everyone benefits from that. You learn a lot by writing down your opinions on other people's pictures. And obviously they benefit a lot from, from you doing that too. That forum is also great for asking questions where you can get honest and private um, advice on whether it's um, equipment or dealers or travel or whatever. And so people really enjoy that aspect of having a chance to chat to a group of underwater photographers they've been interacting with and can ask honest questions and get really honest feedback. Um, beyond that, it's um, you can find out much more information on the Photography Experts website, and I'll post a link to that 
below this video and also on my website that you can read some testimonials from people who've, who've, who've survived the course so far um, to get a bit of feedback and hopefully a few people who've done the course might add some comments below this video. But that's my five minutes up. So hopefully that's given you an insight. And if you fancy signing up, the new course will be launching fairly soon. So if you visit the Photography Experts website, there's a sign up form on there to get an announcement um, about when courses are launched and all the courses we've run so far are filled up the moment we put that announcement out. So it's, it's important to get on that list if you want to get a spot on the course. So um, I'll put that link below, but otherwise hopefully see you online. Bye.